Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 10th, okay? So, the timing is fluid. Not every reading is for you. This is just something that is coming in, and today, tomorrow, next week, something like that. What do we have for a message today? What do we have for a message today? Oh, moon reverse. This is right around the 10th, right? Ace of Swords. Truth. Truth. Some sort of truth is coming out on this day. Something that was hidden is about to be revealed. This is awakening, a wake-up call. There's been some sort of illusion or confusion. This is clarity. It is clarity. So something is going to be made very, very clear. Just like that. It was unclear. Now it's clear. Ooh, definite clarity. Oh my goodness. Now this is a uh, wish being granted. This is a blessing. It's a blessing in disguise after the tower has fallen. There's obviously been something that was false because the tower comes before the star. And the tower is falseness, it's false beginnings, it's false impressions, it's false sense of security. So there's been some lies, there's been some deception. Clarity is coming, okay? Some sort of truth is coming out. This is help arriving or a wish being granted. Healing energy. It's a blessing that something has happened. It really is. This is also the sword of power. So it's the sword of truth. So somebody is going, there could be a shift in power. There's protection here. There is justice. Ooh. In reverse, this is an in, so there's been an injustice. There's definitely been some lies. Somebody has not been telling the truth. There's an imbalance here. Could be a mental imbalance. Doesn't have to be, but there's been an injustice. There's been unfair treatment. Somebody, there's bad karma here. There is bad karma. Somebody has lied. They have lied. The truth is coming out. There's protection here. There's falseness. There's obviously uh, a lack of integrity. There could be news of legalities that are coming. Somebody has... Uh, Lied about the facts, obviously. Mm. Six of Cups. The Sun. Wow. So this is a new day. It's a new beginning. It's a breakthrough. It's the birth of a new life. This is reminiscing reminiscing about the past there could be a reconciliation here and and reconciliation could be between children could be between parents could be between friends could be between lovers whatever this is a wish being granted that is going to make somebody extremely happy extremely happy there's been some sort of lies somebody's been hiding the truth 
there's going to be some sort of this is an awake a wake up call communication that is coming somebody's wish is being granted there's some it has something this is with somebody that you know there's some sort of um, memories here that are coming up this is this appears to be happy news very happy news this is definitely light being shed on a situation from the past. There's been some sort of grief, right? There's been some sort of grief over a loss because the Five of Cups comes before the Six of Cups. The Five of Cups is grieving. But this is a healing energy. This is a healing energy. So this is healing from the past. So there's a healing energy coming in. The truth will heal things. Okay, it is. So this this is a this is a healing energy. So there's 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 very positive, happy news that is coming. There's been an injustice. There's been lies and deception, illusion and confusion. But this is clarity. And, and this clarity, you know, could come from within. This is protection. Somebody has been hoping and praying for clarity or the truth after an injustice. It is definitely coming. The truth cannot be hidden. It cannot. Okay, and it has been. It has been. But this is a breakthrough. It's a new day. It's a new beginning. It's enlightenment. It's a positive change. It's a yes answer. Your, your wish has been granted. So somebody's wish is about to be granted. I feel like we're looking around the 18th or 19th and I don't I just really feel strongly about that something could happen around the 18th or the 19th we definitely have a renewal here this could just be a new vibration this is awakening this is a new vibration vibrating at a higher level there's there's healing energy here so this is healing you know you think about what comes before the six of cups six of cups is a five, if it comes with six of cups is a five of cups which, which is a breakup it's healing so this is a very healing energy um this is the a rebirth or something like that a new beginning this could be a reawakening of memories of love, remembering what love feels like. This could be a blessing in disguise after somebody has been treated unfairly. This is a this is a new idea, a new approach. You know, somebody is being given a beautiful opportunity here. Something they have been praying for that is going to reawaken their... This is a awakening and this is feelings of love, okay? It is. So there's going to be a shift in energy by the looks of things. Or a shift in power as something, something, something gets cleared up or some truth comes out. Ace of Pentacles. Ace of Pentacles is another yes answer. It is um, a new opportunity for stability and security. Something you can hold on to. This is a gift. This is a gift as well. And this one is too. So this is a gift. Somebody is receiving a gift or they're receiving a golden opportunity that leads them down a path to stability this is abundance. This is abundance as well. Very positive change. Very beautiful. Very, very beautiful. 
this is a gift, an opportunity. Somebody is going to be, somebody is receiving a golden opportunity, okay? This, that's going to make them extremely happy, okay? Um, it's from somebody that they have dealt with in the past or that they are very familiar with, you know, this is this is a gift. It is definitely a gift. Somebody is receiving a gift. This is a gift. Gift. We have a definitely have a gift here, and a gift could just be the truth. Could be clarity. Could it be an actual gift? Something you can touch. It absolutely could be. Somebody is receiving a gift that is uh, real. It is absolutely real. This could also be a reality check. Um, and when I say somebody from the past, people automatically think of their ex. You know, we have past life connections. You need to open your mind. And this is a this is open your mind for sure. Open your mind. We have soul circles with people from our past that come into our life at the right time. That could be your person from the past. There is somebody here that you will feel very familiar with or that you know that is going to be giving you some clarity, giving you a gift. This is a golden opportunity that you can take to the bank that is going to make you extremely happy. Um, this is going to reawaken your feelings of love, whatever it is. This is a very healing energy. Very healing. This is something that you can hold on to, something you can keep. Somebody's going to be receiving something uh, new. This is new. It is new. And it's interesting because this represents the past, but this, this is, these are both new beginnings. This is a new beginning. This is a new beginning. This is a new beginning. So we have a new beginning here. This is something that you prayed for. Somebody has been praying for uh, stability or security or something real or something solid. You know, it, it's coming, whatever it is. This is definitely an offer that uh, is going to make you extremely happy. Or it's news that is going to make somebody extremely happy. There's been unfair treatment. There's obviously been a tower moment because the star wouldn't be here if it wasn't. Star comes after the tower. There's obviously been deception. There's been falseness. But now it is a time of healing from the past. Something is coming that is going to bring a very healing, happy energy. This is something that you can take to the bank. Right? This is something that will last. This is permanent. Somebody is receiving an offer that is beautiful, put it that way. Going down the path to long-term stability. And it feels like there's a reunion here. It does. I feel like there's a renewal or a reunion between two people that know each other, whether they know each other, known each other in this lifetime or another one. There's also angel guidance, okay? This is a guiding light. So it feels like somebody has been guided, two people, it feels like we have two people that have been guided together. Yes, yes.
So whatever this is, it's very positive energy. Um, I think that there is a reawakening of feelings of love in some way. Whether, and I think it's with, you know, and I, it's interesting because it's it's new energy, but it's familiar energy. There's definitely a higher power involved. This has to do with commitment. Faith and trust and truth. Somebody has definitely prayed for something, and I it, it, they have, they have, and I feel like their prayers are being answered. Could be dealing with Taurus, could be dealing with Leo, could be dealing with Aquarius, uh, Pisces, Libra, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Everybody is here. Some sort of new opportunity is coming that is very real, it's honest, after there has been an injustice. The lies, if there's been lies, which there has been, I mean, it's, it's very clear that there has been, there's, there's some sort of clarity or a wake-up call or truth that comes out this this truth causes i believe the tower moment and i feel like there's a realization in regards to what happiness is i don't know somebody is going to be receiving an offer that makes them extremely happy and it's from somebody that they feel very familiar with this is rejection the hierophant is god and this is protection so we've heard it before. Rejection is God's protection. There is a reason why things don't work out. I feel like there's a glowing energy here. Somebody is going to be absolutely glowing with the feelings that they are feeling. Good luck.